Hello. 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 So, you know, it's Italy. Italy. Very good. You're obviously buying up all the... All the The new Duke and Duchess of Edinburgh, Edward and Sophie, arrive in Edinburgh this afternoon, March 10, and were greeted by crowns of the city's royal mail. Sophie, the Countess of Essex, has been made Duchess of Edinburgh following the announcement that her husband, Prince Edward, has been given his late father title of Duke of Edinburgh. As they took part in their first royal engagement with their new titles, the couple spoke with unlockers. Duchess Sophie wore a long wool cream coat with a large button and an open collar for the occasion. She accessories with a grey scarf and a green glass bag. The bag had an envelope shape and a crocodile print. Sophie wore a long turquoise dress with a large puff sleeve and a pleated skirt underneath her long coat. She appears to be dressed in a new tight and a pointy nude heel. Sophie wore a Max Mara custody double-breasted Bruce wool coat in a sand white. The designer is a favorite of a member of the royal family, and many of her creations are owned by Kate, Princess of Wales. The cast study code was 825 pound on Selfridge's website, but is currently out of stock. Selfridge explained this code take the cast study code, for example. Made in Italy, slim fitting style is unsuitable for even the smartest of seasonal occasion. Made entirely of pure wool, button of the calf lying silhouette to keep the curve at bay. While stuffing your hand into the perfectly placed pocket will keep your finger from freezing. As a result, Sophie was in a good hand with the Max Maraco today, as Edinburgh was hit by cold weather. Sophie wore the Sophie Hansback Cleo class in Emerald. Sophie admires Sophie Hansback and on several of her handsbag. The Cleo bag is still available for £343 from Sophie Hansberg website. It is also available in a variety of color including yellow, orange, purple, black, and white. Sophie wore gold earrings today that were adorned with a small multicolored gemstone. Her bracelet were similarly delicate and gold. The Duchess wore her hair in a low abdo and a minimal makeup. She wore a lot of drag mascara to draw attention to her blue eyes. <laughs> Sophie Contest of Versailles wore her Elsa Jacobson raincoat today, which she wore in 2020 and even earlier in 2050. The Countess Sophie pair her navy raincoat with a navy trouser and a pale grey scarf. Sophie wore a navy coat with contrasting orange for an edgy look. Sophie chose it because it was both fashionable and practical. This is because the raincoat is designed to keep the weather warm and dry in cold and wet weather. The jacket has a flint lining and will be timeless in a Sophie wardrobe due to its navy color. Then is Elsa Jacobson three-quarter slang soft shell. For the raincoat is stylish, warm, and offer 100% rain protection according to the description. I think it is no longer available. Royal fan can purchase the same jacket in army color for 276 pounds. Sophie wore a cozy grey scarf underneath her coat to keep warm. The Countess chose navy blue trouser to match her navy jacket, creating a very appeal ensemble. Today in Hemsworth, she wore a pair of very sturdy looking black boots. The Countess was seen wearing a small pair of gold hoop earrings as an accessory. She was also wearing her gleaming and jasmine and her gold wedding band. 
Eddie Levian, CEO of Levian, whose assets are protected Persian Royal Jewelers, spoke about Sophie's and Jasmine. He said Sophie Vesek and Jasmine is a symbol of true love. The center two carat of a diamond is surrounded by two small heart shaped diamonds set into a platinum band. The trilogy diamond and jasmine design with combined three diamond is said to represent a couple unique loving relationship past, present and hope for a beautiful future. Furthermore, platinum is the safest precious metal for storing precious gemstone and it is associated with the resilience and longevity. Prince Edward marked his private wedding proposal with a very meaningful token of romance with this royal engagement ring. Princess Charlene attended a luncheon with a tame woman and sport along with Monaco Minister of State Perry Darlot. This was done to honor International Women's Day which was held on Wednesday. Princess Charlene wore a brand new Akris Nadine double-breasted wool glorek jacket in a dusty blue to the luncheon. The dusty blue double-breasted jacket have a future pick labels or button and two side pocket. Real fans can buy this bracelet 2,929 pounds. Unfortunately, this particular jacket colorway is no longer available. But the royal fan can still purchase a purple jacket in the color Marsala. The sharply tailored nanny jacket is offered this season in a gorgeous wool lurek. This long jacket and massing farida pen created the perfect modern tuxedo, with a pink lapels and double-breasted button detail. Mrs. Charlin chose the ugliest colorful double face trouser in a dusty blue, which are also sold out online. The Navi version costs 658 pounds for the real fan. This acrylic carla trouser and carpet in wool double fit. They have an elegantly shaped waistband, a hidden side chip, a straight length for a classic look, and there are no pockets. Despite purchasing a new suit, Princess Salin reached into her closet for a pair of suits she had since 2014. Princess Arlene Christian Dior heels are made of glazed leather and black kid skins.